going on. Could we, if we had to, without using nuclear weapons ourselves, take out their, their nuclear capability? Well, I certainly want them to believe that that's the case. Well, is it? I absolutely want them to believe that that's the case. <laughs> Mr. Secretary, would you like to add anything to that? I, I think uh, they need to know that, uh, that if they take that step, uh, that they're going to get stopped. What about if they decide to uh, block us off at the Straits of Hormuz? We made very clear that uh, the United States will not tolerate blocking of the Straits of Hormuz. That's another red line for us, and that we will respond to that. And we would be able to, could they actually, General, do they have the capability to actually block off that, that uh, waterway, which is, of course, where all the oil to get it out of that part of the world comes they, from? They've invested in uh, capabilities that, that could, uh, in fact, for a period of time, block the Straits of Hormuz. We've invested in capabilities to ensure that if that happens, we can uh, defeat that. And so to, the simple answer is, yes, they can block it. Um, of course, that is as well a, uh, we've, we've described that as an intolerable act. And it's not just intoler intolerable for us, it's intolerable to the world. But we would take action and, and reopen the Straits. A lot of people, Mr. Secretary, say we ought to just tell the Israelis quietly, look, if you need to take out that nuclear uh, capability in Iran, go ahead, uh, that'll be fine with us. Uh, what would happen if Israel does decide to take this matter into its own hands, and what would be our reaction and response to that? I think, I, you know, our preference is that the, the international community, including Israel, ought to work together on this issue. Uh, we, face, we, we have common cause here. Uh, we're not interested in them developing a nuclear weapon. We are not interested in them uh, proliferating uh, violence throughout that uh, region. We are not interested in them uh, trying to assist in terrorism. We are not interested in them trying to destabilize governments uh, in that region or any place else. We have common cause here, and the better approach is for us to work together and not act But what if the Israelis did that? If the, if the, the Israelis uh, made that decision, we would have to be prepared to uh, protect our forces in that situation, and that's what we'd be concerned about.